Okay, everybody, welcome back to Satisfactory. It's a little bit later in the day. I'm a little bit more woken up, and I'm ready to rock and roll. So, what are we doing right now? We have a manufacturer ore, this bad boy here. We finally have built one. It's upstairs, and we are trying to figure out a way to send things up to it. Um, and we were going to build a screw making apparatus upstairs but we're kind of seeing this and we're seeing that these screws are kind of backing up right like they're kind of backing up we, we probably could tap into this screw belt and we could uh you know we could get screws from here and i think what we're going to do is just that but here's my problem um that's a merger i have to steal from after so i guess i could do a split block here and send it up into that. So let's go ahead. I guess it's going to be logistics and it's going to be the hole in the floor. Yes. Yes. Um, okay, let's do this first. Let's do this. Let's, let's get the, the splitter. Let's put the splitter in. For the screws. They're going to be a place that's never going to... There's always going to be overlap. So let's go ahead and just... Oop, put it right there. And then we're going to have it go out up there. So now we know where that hole needs to go. It needs to go right about there. Um, get the conveyor boat hole right there, I guess. That doesn't seem right. The only bad thing about this game is that it's really difficult to um, to do some of these hookups. You know what I'm saying? Like it, it's really difficult to make that work. Okay, so that was a little bit. Like I don't I don't know how to do it. <laughs> like I just I don't know how to. To make that to make that look right um it just doesn't line up does it can i do that and then can you snap around it like that no that doesn't look good um Maybe it doesn't go right there, then. Maybe we can put some, put it somewhere else. I just... I didn't line these things up. Like, they're in the middle, right? So there's no... I don't think there's ever going to be a place where they... It, like, lines up perfect. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's always going to be, like, kind of right... It would be nice... You just keep pointing right there. Ooh, maybe maybe I did. Maybe I just did it right there. Maybe maybe it pointed correct. Ah, oh, no, it doesn't. It's off by just a little bit. How did we do it over there so easy? How did we do it over there? Like when we did, where does it go through? I know it goes through somewhere. We had to send something through the ceiling. Those. Why did they go through so well? Oh, because we built that and then we built the extender down okay okay the first thing we did was build the hole okay let's just say we built it somewhere like right there so it looks nice then we built five then we brought that down and we do something like I guess that and then Man, that is so close. It's so close to being right. So now we do the splitter. We just try to hook that up 100% with that. And then there's going to have to be a conveyor belt that goes inside. What am I seeing here? I see the blue. Did I do that one wrong? Is that an output and not an input? Is that what the deal here is? That. 
So that needs to be an input. How do you switch? Mm. How do you switch that? Hold on here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How do you switch it from being an output to an input? Quick switch E. I did nothing. Mm, toggle build mode, rotate, build menu, or build it. Oh, it's just it's just the little things, you know. Like how do you change it from being an output to an input? What does that do? Good thing I have my old trusty phone here on me. What is this called? A conveyor belt? Okay, here we go. How do you switch a conveyor lift in Factorio from input to output? To build, a, a, to build an upward lift, click on the floor or snap any missing belt or output. Move your mouse upward to adjust the height. Build a downward lift. Use the mouse wheel to rotate the output direction. Oh, you click it once, then you do it. Okay, so you come down here. You say, I want it to hook up that. Nope, that builds it. Mm. I thought you could come here, and then click it, and then it would be like the, the things where it would stay for a second, it would stay put, and then you could do what you needed to do. That's it. What a pain in the booty. What a pain in the booty. I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to do it. And I hate that you can't right mouse click to back out of the building menu. I hate that. Because the right mouse click doesn't do anything. Like, right mouse click brings up the build menu. Like, it, doesn't, it doesn't do anything for me. You... Jeez, how do you switch it from being input to out? Can I click it there and do that? No, it won't go through the thing correctly. It won't snap into it. Like that does. And maybe I just put it like that. But they're both outputs. I mean, what? I can just look at it. Dismantle. Mass dismantle. Oh my goodness. I'm going to spend 20 minutes on this. There you go. R. You hit the R button. Jeez. That was painful. Alright. We already have screws going up. Perfect. Perfect. Now we go over here. Sorry for your YouTube people, the sun has set, so it's super dark, you couldn't see anything. But we now are stealing uh, screws from that line and we're sending them up north. Which is fantastic, because that's one of the things I'm sure that we need to make those heavy modular frames. The other thing we need is the frames right there and then the encased stuff right there. So, I again, I'm going to open this up, do foundations. Build some foundations across this way. And then open this up. Logistics conveyor bolt conveyor belt hole. Put one like right there for that one. And then for those right there. Okay. So then that come down. Gonna hook into the encased there that one's gonna come down into that that and then we're gonna do a splitter splitter is gonna hook directly into that did I just screw that up standing right in front of it I did splitter Right 
directly into that. I did it again! Something screwy with that. Let's try it one more time. Do it that way. Okay. Next thing with that one. Oh, I put it on the... I don't know if this is going to be good because I put it where there's a a deal, a stacker, and it's gonna it's gonna always want me to like it's gonna say like, hey, you went on the stacker, you went on the stacker, you're still on the stack, I don't know. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it won't. Maybe I can do it. Yeah, it's always gonna be on the stacker. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. Move this over just a wee bit. That that way. I think it's gonna be like that. I'll put a splitter. The splitter will go directly into it like that. Okay, now please. I don't see anything moving up on that lift. Maybe the splitter is not lined. Ah! I really hate how you can't right click out of it. Like every other game I've ever played in my entire life, you've always been able to right click out of a build menu. So when I get here, I'm never ever going to not try to right click out of a build menu. That would be so sweet. It would do that automatically, just hook up to it. Maybe if I do it like that, maybe it'll do it now. Perfect, perfect, perfect. It's taking it up. Now this one's not doing it, but let's try the same thing here. Let's see, perfect. Nice. Alright, let's go up. Well, let's see where the stuff, I don't even know where this stuff is going to come out at, but I do know that we need it and it's up there, so. Let's go. Let's go. Man, what a horrible start to a video, huh? Tons and tons of stress. So we're not going to need that, 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 or that, or even that. We're just going to have you hook in directly there. Wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Okay, let's go find out where the other three things popped up at. There's one, there's two, and three. Interesting, interesting. So, oh, so I don't see the, see those. Oh, maybe, maybe because they're just they're a little bit smaller. Yeah. All right. Um. Uh oh. Uh oh. This thing has shut down. We are out of steel. Um. Yeah, we're out of we're out of uh, the steel deals. Let's just go ahead and double check. I think that's what we wanted it to happen, so we can get rid of that. We can get rid of that. And now. Uh, we can just do a splitter, and really, I guess I'll put the splitter in halfway. Put the splitter in halfway. Yeah, halfway, right there. And run that out. Can I run it up to that? Stick right in for me. Of course it wouldn't. Why would it? This is what I was saying, is that the gentleman told me that to make a real splitter, you have to point at the deal. You have to get up here and you have to point directly at it. Then he said it should line up every time. Let's see. It is. Yep. Perfect. 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 He knows what he's talking about. Now that we have these little steel beams going into that thing again it should start manufacturing there it is manufacturing those things we need 2500 we have 1500 so that's fantastic now i want to think is that over there is that the best place to put that huge manufacturer or because we have two here and what can i do i can bring these out and i can send them like this way right and i'm running down this way And then send them this way. This one comes out and meets here, right? 
and then there's one over there. That one I can I can run it down. I guess it's I guess it's not that big a deal. Mm -hmm. I was just trying to think like should it be over there in the corner? And I guess that's okay. Like it just needs to make we just need to start making some, and once we start making some, then we'll you know more and more will pop up. So it's good. Um, oh no, how am I supposed to do this? There's a hold on now. How do you how do you bring it out of the floor? Like when I when I did that one, I could just click on that and it would. You see what I'm saying? Like when I did this one, yeah. See how it just goes there? Like it just clicks. This one is not going there and clicking. Can't bring a can't bring a deal out of that. Yeah. What's the deal here? Why can't I bring this out of the floor? Uh, why can't I bring that out of the floor? It's going up. It's clicking in and going up. Why can't I bring it out of the floor? It seems like that would be something I can do. Maybe if I... Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, go that way. Forget you can alter your movement on that. Maybe if I try to upgrade it. Maybe if I try to say it's a Mark III, it'll, it'll let me do it. Negative. I can upgrade it, but I can't do anything with it up here on this side. Can't do anything with it up here on this side. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, perfect. Okay. Perfect. Okay, I don't know what happened there, but something happened. Just took a little finesse. Yes, yes. So now, I guess it should look like... I, yeah, it's, it doesn't... It's fine. It's fine. Oh my goodness. This game... It's, it's so funny, like, sometimes I really want to play this game, and then sometimes I get really kind of frustrated with it. And I, I don't really know what I'm doing it for, you know? I don't really know why I'm going through all the pain and heartache. And all the frustration. Because, you know, I have to give up something. This, this is time I could be spent hanging out with my kid. I'm sure she's bored. Even though, like, she's hanging out with her cat and everything, like, I'm sure that she would rather hang out with me or do something with me. Sometimes I'm just like, ugh, do what I want you to do. <laughs> Alright. Do that in a turn. I wonder how. That way. That way. This one will come out, so we'll now have two. Then, jeez, I guess we turn this way now. We come down this way. I mean, it's so silly. I'm having to go all the way around this thing, but I think in the future it'll, it'll look good. Then you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and make the turn right here. One, two, three. And the last one will be here. One, two, three, four. Okay, let's see this gigantic cluster get figured out. Uh. Okay, so that starts. You're gonna go up. Hmm.
Yes. That is in the way. That is in the way. And it's so funny because it's the same thing that we're bringing up. So funny. Just right, like they're the exact same thing. Alright, well, let's, let's get rid of that for a second. And let's continue right down this path. We'll do we'll do a splitter there or something. Yeah, you're out, Osborne. Out. out. I'll show you who's out. That's the Spider-Man. I'm not going crazy. Just remember that that little scene. William Defoe, outstanding actor, outstanding. Really happy they brought him back for the Spider-Man movies, the second installment with uh, Tom Holland, I believe his name is. My goodness, looks a little weird, doesn't it? it really does. What are we out of? We're out of the those things. Man, I gotta I gotta change my key binding so I can just right click. <laughs> gotta change my key binding so I can just right click out of building. Oh, I love that. It's got two hundred of those. Love it. go up and over put you in there can you oh no no it can't go up because we're having something else going up this has to go to a merge okay let's do a merge block then logistics merge oh my goodness so hard to get up on a like an uh, just a, an area to look at. Hmm. Perfect. That's a merge block. Okay. Then I got, I'm immediately going to have to put a splitter right after it. Silly as that. Fix. Not come out. Okay, go right into there. Pick that up. Get right into there. Let's see how this goes. Okay, so we're finally emptying it out that huge connex, and we're we're sending stuff into there so we can get done. Lovely. Okay. Step one, the more difficult process, over. Uh-huh, right there. Perfect. Perfect. Good. Better. phone has, has rung. Let's see who wants to talk to me today. I've been wanting a truck for a long time now, and uh, there was a raffle at work for a really, really, really nice truck, and they had it last night. So I stayed up a little late, wondering if I had won the raffle. I did not get a telephone call, so I assume I did not. Um, looks like I just need one more. Perfect. It's just going to be the screws coming up. Now, it would be nice 
do eight. Let's do that. Let's do that. Do that. Is this one gonna be a booty patootie like the other one was? Seems like it is. Let's do that. Five. For some reason they, they they're like okay with it. For some reason they are okay with it if you I don't know, if you can click on the bottom part, they're okay with it, but you can't click on the top part and get what you need, so. Foundation again before I fall over. And then we're going to do a merge block. We're going to merge it right. Really. You're not really showing me that you lined up with, oh, I guess because we didn't go up Oh, it can't do that. It doesn't like that at all. I guess there's a there's a twist that it doesn't like. Um, let's try this again. Nope. It did it for a second. There you go. Let's do that this time. Merge. Right. I guess I guess it likes going downhill, then it likes going uphill. Perfect. Seven. That. 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 Here, all the way up to there. Perfect. That goes into middle one Put into that one Put into that one okay. you go into the, oops why won't why won't you go in oh I don't have enough belt parts I was about to lose my mind for a second um yeah you're already spoken for dang okay so you, the pipe really should be on the bottom level. So the pipe really should be on the bottom level. Now. Okay. Let's go get some more steel beams. We'll hook that up appropriately. And see, now these things are coming out super slow. We're not going to have that vast reservoir reservoir that we had over here before and that's why I didn't want to pull them out from the back I wanted to pull them out from the front so that everybody was contributing but I didn't really have any room from the front up here to pull out but I guess I can just steal them from there just do that perfect okay let's go back over here hook this back up That goes to there. That goes to there. You, my fine feathered friend, you come right through here. And there's no input for you, but there is that. That's how you're gonna do it. Looks weird, but that's you. Hey, okay. you go into there. You go into there, and you into there. Okay. Get rid of that again. Really, get rid of that now, because we don't need it. That's just a little extra. More pipe will come off. Okay, perfect. Perfect. And then the screws. What's wrong with the screws here? What's wrong with the screws? You don't feel like you're a real hook up there. A real merger block. Uh, I really wish you could. There was something like in the other, like Factorio, where you can build the thing where you don't. Your character doesn't doesn't move on a belt. I forget the name of it, but there was there was like a there was like a pair of legs, like power legs, that would make it where you didn't move on the the belt at all, like you stayed stationary. All right, there we go. I 
Let me go over there and, and turn these. Uh, I'll, I'll go ahead and just turn it on, but we really need to, to make the level three um, vertical conveyors. Like that, that needs to be a thing, but I'll go ahead and turn this thing on. Why not? Uh, power? Just gonna say, how hard is this? <laughs> there we go. There it is. Great calamity. These 100 screws, frames, and it's making one heavy modular frame. Making two a minute. Out here. Organization. We'll put one of these big industrial stores that and then I don't think it's gonna need a super fast hookup let's see is it turning on now I like to see the animation oh yeah there it is in the middle pretty cool pretty cool let's go over here and upgrade that stuff though mark three conveyor belts or vertical conveyor belts rather especially the screws Mm -hmm. We'll go downstairs and look. I think we have to upgrade the top and the bottom. Okay. Oh, that's upgraded. Let's see if I was saying is that one. Top and the bottom, so that looks better now. And let's go here where the screws were at. The screws to do a three-way on that hmm that looks like the top isn't moving as quickly does it let's go back up to the top and see what's wrong up there right 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 It's the, uh, it's this thing. It's a conveyor belt. There it is. Now things should be flowing a little bit quicker. Let's look over there and see. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, now it's a full, now it's a full continuous line. It will be the screws that slow us down. But maybe we will. Maybe we'll, we'll build another screw thing up here and we'll just, we'll just have it like feeding into that one. Who, who knows? It really would be nice if, if, like, the bottom level, if, like, this bottom level one had... Oh, you're not supposed to run. Oh, you're not supposed to run. You're not supposed to run a belt through the bottom. The bottom is so that you can walk. Yeah. Yeah, you're not supposed to... You're not supposed to build a belt right here. You're supposed to, you're supposed to click them together like that so that they all... You can walk underneath it. Yep. Makes sense now, doesn't it? Alright, have you made one yet? It is, it's building one. Hallelujah. Oh yeah, it's, de it's definitely going to have max screws. Look at that. It has all the modular frames it can hold. It has all the steel pipe it can hold. And it has all the beams it can hold. How many screws does it hold? I bet 500. Let's see if it gets to another 100. Let's see if there's any left over. It won't. Idle. Oh, it's having to wait for the next hundred screws. Okay, there's that. What are we running at? What efficiency? Sixty-two percent. Yeah, it's, it's getting nowhere near the amount of screws it needs. Hmm. I wonder if we should, we should overclock the other screw makers we have, or we just bite the bullet. And like I said earlier, we have so many freaking steel rods down there on that line that we just expand out, maybe like right here a little bit, 
and we we make some because there's so many steel rods right there we just expand out right oh that'd be perfect that would be perfect we expand out right down there we build four more machines to make screws and they just come right up here and they click in is that a, is, these are merger blocks right yeah so they, they can just click in right there that's almost perfect to build more screws right there because all those back there like all those are screws and then the screws go up yeah so we, we can pull them off right there pull them off right there go up on that side move it out more screws on this area perfecto let's just check and see how our power is i think our power is more than yeah, we're more than good on power hope the coal over there is doing well too i hope we're getting coal to the very end because we've been we've been kicking up the power right so we're using more and more coal so i kind of hope that if you look over there you can kind of see it start and stop for just a second so i think we're good i think we're good all right how much is this 30 minutes I guess I'll go ahead and lay out that here then. We're going to make more screws over here. Probably four. Four screw making machines right over here. So, have the rods come off right here. Or have them come off right here, bend this way, and go this way, this way, this way. We have a manufactured one, two, three, and then we'll do four. I like, I like them to come up. I like them to come up right there, though. So, how else can I do this? Okay, so they come up that way. He goes input down that way. One, two, three. Maybe just do three machines. And then and then here have them come that way. And then have the output here. And it comes up. Ooh, yay, we made a new video has been uploaded. Um da, da, da. I really would like it where this is the output. But that comes up. Goes all the way around there. Still three again. Yeah, I can. I can. Okay. Okay. Da, 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 da. And this this is just going to be good all around, you know. So I don't really mind spending some time doing this. Um, like we're going to need a lot of screws. So the only thing I really kind of don't like doing is. Um, not taking it from from right here. It's the only thing I don't like doing. I'd like to take it. Oh, maybe I can take it from right here. Maybe I can. I can send it right that way. Have the belt come this way. Then goes down this way. That would give me four. Have the output belt. Have the output belt come up this way. Wrap around and go back down for the screws, and then it terminates right up there to that. Perfect. Yeah, let's do that. And the reason why I want to take it off right there is because I want to, I want to, ha I want to keep the continuity of the, of the the factory together. Like I want it, I want it to have the same function. Those inside the shadow there. Where am I? Did I just delete something? I did. I deleted that. Oh, I deleted it because of the, um, because of uh, me deleting that that splitter. Oh, that was the wrong one. I want to get rid of this guy. I got rid of the thing that, that puts him into this. Interesting. <laughs> Oopsie doodle. Merger. That. That. Here again. It would really be nice if they had just another color to show when the, the ins and outs when the these things were lined up It'd be so nice I can't really tell looking at it this way most of the time I can't tell I know they say that that's the 
And it, just, it gets so frustrating to constantly have that problem over and over and over and over. I just feel like that's not a problem that we ought to be having. But that's something that... Ah! Uh, that that's something that really needs to be addressed. But I just can't look at it and know. You know? Like, I can't do that. You're kidding me. And, of course, right-click does not stop. What is this? Am I even doing it right? This is a, a merger, right? I am doing a merger. What? What? God in heaven, how did I ever get this done the first time? We do it this way. Okay. Perfect. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. And then, again, it'd be some, so nice if there was some place just to stand. top of this. Can I climb up there? Perfect. And then now I want to do splitter. Oh my god. Apparently I have oh, apparently I have messed this up now. Or it doesn't like something I have done. that allow the flow of why not why not why won't you hey merging my mind over this. Okay. Okay, just calm down. Calm down. It's okay. Just a really big pain in the booty. That this game should have addressed many, many years ago, but they just haven't done it. That's okay. Okay. Just like that. Just like that. Oh, it's not doing it again. It's not... Okay, alright. Let's do it one more time. See what? We're getting rid of that piece. Getting rid of that piece. Getting rid of that piece. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna get rid of it. I'm gonna put that right there. So it goes to the right. Out from here into that. It's not lined up perfectly anymore. It's gonna go off to the right a little bit. But you know what? the world we live in now just to get our iron rods back to where they're supposed to go okay that was a humongous pain in the butt so now comes off here goes down to this place yep it's under Gonna turn head down this way. Perfect. And we're going to have all the constructors. Come on, give me a nice straight line. And all the constructors for the sprues are going to be here. Oh my goodness gracious. So one. Two. Three. Okay. 
So sorry, everybody. So sorry. That, uh, I'm being a little bit of a pain to deal with today. If you understand my frustration, if you've ever played this game, I love it. I really do. But I really think that Factorio has the right... I think Factorio has the right, right idea here. I don't think this is straight either. No, not straight at all. Not straight in any freaking form of the imagination. <laughs> oh, pathetic. You know what? Maybe I should just do this. I want it to go that way. The input to be that way. I want it to go out that way. There definitely, I'll, I, will, I will say this about this game, there definitely is, I think, a right way to do some things, and I think there's a wrong way to do some things. Like, like the right way to do splitters and mergers is to just put them down first and then have the, these conveyor belts go into them. The, the wrong way, wrong way, is to try to put the belts down first and then have these, and like, and like attach these things to the belt from there. Talk about what you're making. Cruise. 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 You know what? In all this time, I can't. Even, I can't I, in all this time, we have research we could be doing. Maybe I'll go over here and do a little bit of research. Just unwind for a second. Why not? The hard drive should have been done like 20 minutes ago. So I get to pick. What do I want? Fine concrete. Alternative blueprint blueprint for copper alloy. Or alternative blueprint for insulated cable, which is plastic and that. None of these are good. Fine concrete. So you do 15 for 10. 15 for 10 doesn't sound good at all. And then 10 copper, 5 iron. Yeah, I guess that doesn't sound right at all. The sulfur, I can't do anything with because I don't have the gunpowder. I didn't get sulfur when I went out last time. I don't have the 100 quartz yet. I've never already seen a purple slug. I need more delicious nut berries before I get that thing. Cloth, I have no idea how to get cloth. I feel like 10 of those wouldn't be a problem. I feel like I have 10 of those ingots. I have 40 of them. What a dumb dumb. Where is it? This one? There we go. Yeah. And, and more, more pocket space. Just need screws on that one, really. Mikey bars, I have those. I don't have to have that research. Oh no, I don't have to have that research done. Okay. And I, um, can't queue it up. Oh, that stinks. Oh, anyway, I'm gonna put that back. Where are they there? 30. Okay, well, that was fun. A little break. Get back to work now. Can't believe I didn't understand not put anything on the first row. Okay, here comes my output. I think I wanted it to go... That's not... Uh, disappointment. So let's do a merger. Do 
you want it to go that way, correct? Yes. Put the mount to go that way. Mount to go that way. Go that way. Mount to go that way. Um Damn. Should have went the other way. That way it would have could have turned it. Yep, it went the other way. Let's see if I can actually do the mass. Hold left click. Oh no. Oh shoot. Everything I'm looking at. Everything you look at. Ha ha ha. How about that? You guys see that happen? I learned a new skill today. People talk about those, uh, Oh man, uh, Elden Ring. That game will break you because of how hard it is. Play this game. <laughs> Not hard, it's annoying. I really do think Factorio has it right, though. I think this is the more... Factorio is, is better because you don't have to worry. You, don't, you, you can see what you're doing. Whereas this, like you're one man building it, like that doesn't even make sense. All the way up there. Let's grab that. Way down here. Oh, rip. We were off just a little bit. Do seven. Get around like that. And then it would be really nice if we could get it to look straight. That looks good. There we go. Then all the way up there. Oh, I hooked into it. Good, good, good. Going through that, though. See, now this would be cool where you could grab like that and you could just like click it onto it. You know what I mean? Like you could just, you could just click it so it would, it would aesthetically look better instead of you having to put that down first, then having to put this, right? There should be a way to aesthetically click it. So that has to go out. Now, how did we how did we do this last time? Like that, I guess. Right. Then logistics. Free belt. Very top one. I forgot how to do it. We, I think we 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 put that on the ground. I'll have to go up there. Let me let me let me go ahead and wire this up so it'll start working. There, there, cable to there, to there. Look at that, you to there, there, and then you. Wonderful. screws and now let's go figure out how to make this look appropriate there we go okay mm, okay uh yes fine all the way up and instead yeah it'll be going yeah, that's it this will be going out I'll be an output. That look good. That should be over to the right just a little bit. But where it's at now, over to the right just a little bit. Maybe that one would be better. Oh yeah, that, look, that, looks, that looks so much better. Down here to that. Get input. Perfect. And then do a mark three and make you a mark three. 
Okay. I think that's actually working. Let's go look. There is a OSHA violation there. Hold on, let me just go ahead and fix that. Here, look right quick. Okay. It doesn't line up perfect, but I think it's lining up enough. I think that thing is pretty saturated now with screws. Let's see. Ah. <sighs> At 24%, it's going to get the next 100 before it's done building that one. Okay, so it's got 200 on hand now. It should probably get to 300 before it builds this one. Right? No, no, it won't. No. Okay, 174. We can get to 250 before it gets to 80, then we should be okay. Yep, there it is, 250 before 80. So it says it's 71% efficiency. It needs to make at least two per minute before it'll get to 100% efficiency. Be nice to see it break 300. I didn't. I didn't see if last time it did. I was watching the other thing. Let's see if it'll break 300. Ooh. Okay, perfect. So we are accruing more screws than we are losing. The percentage down here, though, it's not. Oh man, I wonder if that. You know what? You, it'd be nice if there was like a reset button you could click. Because if this is an average, it's going to have to get to 100% by, by running at 100% for like 2 or 3 minutes. Well, not 2 or 3 minutes, like 30 minutes. I think it'll hold 500. Sure it will. Okay. Alright, I'm happy with that. So, now, eventually the this thing will back up it won't need any more screws that whole thing will back up and then we'll have the same saturation we had before down there on the bottom where we did this right i don't think we're losing saturation with the frames you know or anything i, have, I think we're doing pretty good the only thing now that i'm worried about is the steel Now the only thing I'm worried about is steel. Like we're just, we're not making enough steel. Which is weird because we make so many steel ingots. We're just not, maybe, maybe we're, we're making too many pipes, steel pipes. We need to make more steel beams. Hmm. Well, anywho, how many more of those do we have before we cut off this part of this module maker thing? Maybe it's only like 20 more left. Oh, goodness. Nope. There's... That's a larger number than I thought. There's steel pipe. Ugh. Rotors. Casings. Okay. All right. Then what did, what did this go to? Nice. Nice. Clean up this base a little bit more. This factory. Okie dokie. Let's go up there and let's grab some of the... Heavy frames, heavy modular frames. I, I think we probably should have 25 done by now. I think we should have 25. And then we'll go, we'll do some more research. But I think we should have 25 done by now. Okay. Let's go look. I'm going to say we're going to have 37 done. Forty-one, nice. Like all of those. Yoink. Down here to this. 
put that in. I'm supposed to have 100 of those, 200 of those, and 3,000 of that. I can make this work. I can make this work. Um, let's go grab five 3,000 copper wire. That should be pretty easy to do. And then the motors, I'll go snag them, and we'll push the button on the fluid transport. Yeah, there's 200. 500. There's 1,200. 1,700. 23. 28. I have 300 left over in my pocket. Perfect. Perfect. And then the motors, I think, are at the very end of the factory, over where, from where I came from. And the the steel rods are still backed up, so we're not even we're not even making a dent steel rod production. Okay. Quick. We got a text message. I want to make sure everything's okay. Yep. Just emails. I gotta get out of here though. It's been an hour. Do this last thing with the the engines, and then we'll get out of here. Motors, rather. Uh, motors are probably made over there, to tell you the honest truth. I think motors are the very, very last things that we're making. Perfect. Get two stacks of that. And I'm noticing here that we're not building something. What are we out of? Just taking a hard time for the satyrs to get around. What are you making? You need satyrs, too? You're making motors? Interesting. What's up with the Seder production? Why are we not making those like pancakes? It just takes a while. It just takes a while, that's all. Okay. It just takes a while. Let's go over here and turn these things in. Then push the big red button. Okay. I was gonna slide underneath that. Okay, I'll slide underneath that. Thanks, 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 thanks. Over here to this. Our pocket dimension pockets have been made bigger. Wonderful. And I think that's probably all we can do. Yeah, for just right now. I think we're good there. Over here to this thing. That's done. And then the motors. That's done. Big red button. Woo! Milestone reached. Fluids can now be packaged to allow for transportation via vehicle and conveyor belts. Additionally, highly improved biofuel can now be produced. That would make sense because the, the trucks and stuff need the biofuel, so that's cool. Bye, buddy. Bye, buddy. All right. So now, what do we want to do? What's our next milestone? A tier 6 milestone? Hmm, that wouldn't be that hard to do, to tell you the honest truth. We probably have that stuff laying down there right now, and then we just have to wait for those. So pipeline would be super simple. Uh, this one would be difficult because I don't know how to do the computers. I'm not building any computers yet. Ooh, now that I can do packaged fuel. Dude. How can we not go for the jetpack? Fuel generator. Oh, cool. So that uses fuel instead of coal. Conveyor belt mark four. And we can. Oh, I thought we already could scan for the for that thing. With our deal. Maybe that was just like the little the little thing where you like click 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 click. You do it with a hand dealio. I don't know how to do that. I don't know how to make fabric. So that will be... A, we're going for the jetpack next. We're going for the jetpack, brothers. Jet. Uh, jetpack? Okay. Alright. Well, I'm going to go ahead and say goodbye. Thank you for watching this episode. I hope we got a lot done. I hope you're uh, excited about the future. I most certainly am. You have to run and slide. There you go. There we go. Um, 
I don't really know if there's anything right now that we need to be worried too terribly much about. Um, we're making the heavy modular frames, and with those, we're going to build more of these gigantic manufacturing dealios. Right? We're going we're gonna to build more of those things somewhere. I don't know where. We're going to build more of those. Like, what, what do they even... Let me just look right quick. Before I say goodbye, let me just look. What is it? The computer. Okay. Which I guess means... Which I guess means that the computer chip, that little motherboard thing, I bet you can make that in an assembler. Look at that. Fabric is in here. Like powder is in here. And now the circuit board. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Plastic and copper sheet. Cake. 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 That copper sheet will probably have to... I mean, we're not using it for anything. Like, absolutely nothing. It's just been sitting there the entire time. That copper sheet will probably run all the way down the length of the factory to where the plastic comes in at. The plastic comes in down there. And we'll probably, from right there, where that little flat part is, we'll probably extend the factory out over the water. And we will probably build the circuit manufacturing and computer manufacturing areas down there to tell you the honest truth why uh look at that I, they're not making rods down there because there's just there's no use for rods like even doing this and like having these screws here like they're still just not enough i don't think we're going to have a screw problem i think i think we're going to be pretty good but that's for another day thank you so much for watching have a good day i will see you in the next one and bye-bye